Once again, this House is memorialising innocent people killed by cowardly attackers. We're offering our thoughts and prayers to families in Quebec City that today are mourning their fathers, husbands, brothers and sons. Innocent people who merely went to pray and who will not be coming home. This terrorist attack strikes at the very heart of one of the freedoms we cherish as Canadians, the right to practice one's faith, to worship without fear. It is the freedom to worship as you choose with your fellow believers as a community in safety and security. We have profoundly defended that right for people around the world, but it is most meaningful to us at home in Canada. An attack against a place of worship, against people praying in a mosque, is an attack on these very freedoms. It negates the principles on which Canada was founded. Yet what we must never be blind that such terrible motivations as hatred or ignorance persist. We cannot stand for it and we must be ready to meet it. This attack offers another sad reminder that our country is not immune to terrorism and it demonstrates that we must always be vigilant against this threat. And today we're incredibly grateful for those who stand vigilant on our behalf, including the police, the first responders, as well as the Canadian forces and our intelligence agencies. And we appreciate their swift response last night. The terrorist attack at the Centre Culturel Islamique de Québec last night has shaken this country. In this moment, families are mourning the loss of their loved ones and praying for those who are injured and fighting for their lives. <clears throat> to our Muslim brothers and sisters, we mourn with you, we pray with you, and we promise that we will stand united and fight against the forces of hatred, bigotry, and Islamophobia and against those who peddle the politics of fear and division. People today feel unsafe in their place of worship. Many feel unsafe in their communities. And that's just not something that we can accept. This is not the Canada we believe in. It's not the type of society we want to live in. Canada is a country of diversity, peace, and inclusion. We cannot and we will not tolerate hate and violence. Today our hearts are broken, but with love and hope we come together with the shared belief that we will overcome. Thank you. Merci. This is Canada. This is Quebec City. This is a mosque where innocents gathered to worship. We know that much, but we can't understand it because it's so out of order. Does it belong in Canada? It feels as if it couldn't possibly have happened, and yet it did. We will pray, we will work, we will reject intolerance and hatred, and we will say, as our Prime Minister has said, to every single Muslim member of the Canadian family, today we are all Muslims. We stand with you and we will never let there be daylight between a Christian, a Jew, a Sikh, an atheist and a Muslim in this country. We are Canadians and we stand together in love.